So as we've said many times, the efficiency and sort of the, the, the work that you can get out of a heat engine is related to the difference in the temperatures between the hot side and the cold side. So it stands to reason then right now we have this engine sitting here with no heat source underneath, it's just at room temperature. So in theory, if we just cool the top side without even heating the bottom, then we should get the engine to run because then the cold plate will be cold. The uh, quote unquote hot plate would just be at room temperature. So we're gonna try it. We're going to put liquid nitrogen on the top without any heat source on the bottom. And let's see what happens. Now I have to be careful not to do it too fast. Otherwise I'll basically freeze up the engine. So I don't wanna do that. So I'm just gonna put a little bit, let it slowly, I guess I'm kind of like walking around a little bit and let it kind of slowly get this thing cold. And then we'll just try it. We'll just try to get it to run and see what happens without any hot source down there at all. So we'll go this direction. So not quite enough yet. Let's add a little bit more. We're going to do it slow. I've done this enough to know that if I, if I cool it too rapidly uh, and just literally dump the liquid nitrogen on there, then it's basically going to, um, then it's basically going to, in that case, essentially seize up. So let's put a little bit more. All right, here we go. And there we go. Now we can see it's now finally cold enough. Without any heat source on the bottom, we're able to get this thing to run because it's not the, the uh, necessarily the absolute temperature that matters. It's the difference in the temperatures between the hot and the cold side. So you can see not only is this thing going, it's actually going you know, at a pretty good clip. So I'm going to add a little bit more. Just to make kind of kind of like slosh the bubbles around to get this thing moving nice and cool. I think it's running pretty good without any heat source on the bottom at all. It's running, right? Because the temperature difference is so great between room temperature and liquid nitrogen temperature. Learn anything at mathandscience.com.